be one three-pointer away from making school history most three-pointers. Now here we go. Battle of the Big Ten and the SEC. And the balls will control Barnes. The head coach of Tennessee puts a lot of pressure on his point guard anyway. First shot of the game. Admiral Schofield. And he knocks down a three right on cue. Good way to start. That was a 77 win, 70 victory for Tennessee over Colgate. Here's Garza, and he draws the foul. He'll go to the line. D.C. area. Look at that box out. That's, that's classroom textbook box out right there by Garza. Cincinnati, that was the first game of the day here on Friday. And look at Bo with that speed dribble. The corner three. Schofield is two for two, and that's his sweet spot right there. Clock to two. And it is Wieskamp misses the three. Off to the races goes Lante Turner. And he'll score it with the left hand. Both of these teams had the music loud, jumping as loud and as high as they could, trying to get hyped for this one, this noon start, as Luca Garza hits a little mid-range of the game. Oh, he swings it. Lamonte Turner for three. And they're falling fast. A whistle, Bohannon runs it down. Rick Barnes furious with the officials. Here's Bohannon for three. Quick release, he got it. Wow. Don't like it, but Bone, look how he gets the ball, pushes it out to a wide open shot, just can't get it. Offensive board, Alexander, and sticks it back. In the program history. Refs are letting him play right there, a little bit of contact on Cook. And there is the whistle, and Williams scores it. Are they gonna count it? They will. And one on their big guys, Cook and Garza. Wieskamp with two on the shot clock. Hits it into the neck. Nicholas Bear with the rebound and the putback. The big guys and even your guards to come attack and help you out if you miss the bucket. Look at Bone. A couple of fakes. Shot fake. Pass fake. Hits a little jumper. And Bone secures the board. That was kept alive by Williams on the run. Bowden and Bowden with the layup. Time out, Fred McCaffrey. And then outscored Cincinnati 17-10 just before the break. Bohannon, long range three, rattles it home, and that's the guy who brings them back typically. Chicago as well, Schofield. Here's Garza, turns in the paint. Offensive rebound, Creener looking for space. Creener scores with a left hand. Crafty. Williams. Flashes to the middle. He's tough. He's strong. And he hits a shot with bodies on him. I'm right, glad the refs are letting him play with their bang. Oh, and he gets a hand on another one. Forces another turnover. In transition, turn it a bone. And the little English on the layup. The corner, Schofield steps into one short. Williams with an offensive rebound. Turner fires a three and hits a three. Pulls down the board, Tennessee four for eight from behind the arc and running right the floor is Alexander. He is fouled. Chance at a three-point trip. 14 with the ball and a chance to go up 20, maybe more. Schofield with the offensive rebound and he'll put it back in the rebounding category. Moss for three. Iowa needed that one. Corner three from Isaiah Moss. He down the floor. Go the balls. Williams gives it up on the cut. Bowden scores and a foul. Earl Schofield and Grant Williams. Rick Barnes telling us they basically manage that locker room. Here's Schofield for three. He's got another one. That's his third. Admiral Schofield is three for three from behind the arc. Hooking violation, so no foul at all. And no hook and hold, no flagrant one. Just as Gene said, here's Moss to the rack and scores the layup. Boy, they've had a tough time getting loose. Balance scoring for Tennessee. Turner had it blocked, but the follow by Schofield. 15 points for Admiral Schofield. 15 points. Iowa has just 19 on the board. Schofield with the ball in his hands. On the take. Too easy for him. His speed, you just can't press, especially when you clear out the backcourt and tell him to go to work. Corner three, Isaiah Moss, his second. And a timeout, Rick Barnes. Here goes Bowden, kicks it, in the corner is Bone, and the three is good! Here's the matchup in the Sweet 16 for the winner here. First possession, ends up as a block, and Tyler Cook all the way, and Cook with a layup. I've been waiting for this. He was contested in there by Kyle Alexander, who is 6'11", and a massive wingspan. Bone all the way in! The layup for Jordan Bone! Turnovers into 12 points.
Tennessee out rebounding Iowa. Oh, Beautiful dunk! Oh, oh, oh. Tyler Cook with the left handed jam and a foul. Turn it in or to say we did this earlier in the year. It doesn't matter. This is a new dance. And we talked about the body of Schofield. We talked about the body of Williams. But I'm telling you, Cook is a beast in there as well. Jumping off the wrong leg. Finished with the strong arm. Season comes back for his junior year. And Iowa quickly down the floor. It is denied. Garza running the floor gets the block. Group box off that time. A rolling rebound for Iowa. It's Tyler Cook. They clear it out. Cook goes again. The reverse. Woo! Sexy right there. Woo! Tyler Cook. They're pick and roll to get others involved. Garza just picking up his third foul. Sent Alexander to the line. He's can't hits a three. Inside and out. That's what they need to do. They just slowed the pace down to get what they wanted. Going up top. Oh, too tall for Bear. Into the hands of Cook. Now Bear goes and scores. This half alone, his first three halves of basketball in this tournament, just one for 14. And here's Cook again, and the friendly bounce, he's feeling it. Tennessee D holds him up. Williams and Schofield on the floor together with three fouls, and it's Schofield trying to calm down this Iowa run. Big shot maker he is. An early start, may have caught Iowa, not by surprise, you know what time the game starts, but sometimes it takes you a minute to get into it. Welcome to the game. Turner gives it, Williams dunks it. Great luck on the drive, Williams was there for him. Williams almost falls down. Shot clock down to nine. It's Williams again. He's the featured act right now. Up and over Garza. Hits that one. With the official that he had the arm bar on the way in. I win a 1-3-1 zone. Williams. High off the window. Scores. Beautiful left hand. Right now, it's not a guard's game for Iowa. It's a big fella's game and get it back to the guards. And here's Moss, hangs and scores. And with Williams sitting on three fouls, he had to retreat. The offense started for Iowa. Dump it inside, Garza. Garza, flurry of moves. Garza up and in. He's got a lot in the toolbox, Luca Garza. Nicholas Bear trying to keep it alive, does so. Here's Bo headed for three. It's good! It's a four-point trip for the Hawkeyes. Shot clock down to eight. Under seven we go here. Turner crosses over Cook. And Turner with the layup. What a move. Four fouls. Both teams in the bonus the rest of the way. Wieskamp dumps it inside. Garza working on Alexander. And foul and one. Luca Garza. A chance at three. Four on the clock, gives it up. Wieskamp, post up. In the corner, Moss. Oh, Isaiah Moss with the shot clock expiring. Cook's face as he defends Turner. Crossover, a spin, kick it. Bowden gives it back. Turner, eight on the shot clock, three-pointer. It's good! Lamonte Turner! Back, everybody calm down. No need for fans to be mad. It's right back where it should have been. Under two minutes. Cook inside. Oh! Smothered by Williams. And a held ball. It'll be Iowa basketball. And, and the up. second time of the game, these two guys meet at the top by the rim. Have enough conditioning to finish it off. And can you keep your patience and not get caught up with the frantic pace? In 2012, that stands as the marker. Uh, Bowden, one out of two. It's a four-point game. You can take a three, but you sure don't need one. You need a score. And Moss goes to the hole, off the window. Two-point game. Timeout. Hawkeyes. Williams and Schofield, not only in the post, but in the slotted area, sneaking behind the offense. Schofield, he'll fire for three. And it's off. Early shot for Schofield with a two-point lead. Each team with two fouls. Bohannon turns a corner. Bohannon off the glass. No. Cook. It's in the air. Wieskamp's got it. And a foul and toughness that they need to summon. Joe Wieskamp, seven for seven from the free throw line today. The freshman from Muscatine, Iowa, has never led in this game. Not once. It is tied again. Money free throws from Wieskamp. Williams working with Turner. Watch out for Williams in the slot area. And it's Bone who takes the shot. No. Ball's up. And it's Wieskamp who has it. He has a timeout. Couldn't get it off. Regulation clock expires. Williams now. A handful. Double team comes. He runs into a wall. Here's Bone for three. This time, he got it. 
Cohn hits a huge three, had a chance to win it with a three late. Now Williams. Yes! Grant Williams and Tennessee putting down the anchor here. He's on him. Now the entry. Williams goes to work, spins, and he hits a jumper. Whoa. Little turnaround is sweet from Grant Williams. That is talking. Of, that is getting to your spot, having confidence in all those hours you shot that shot, and just letting it fly without thinking about it. Bohan and turns a corner, lays it in high off the glass. Quick bucket for the Hawkeye. Oh, he's got to go fast. McCaffrey on the floor, another three-point weapon. McCaffrey looking for Bohan. Bohannon on the take, layup is good. Four-point Tennessee lead. Time is running out on the Iowa Hawkeyes. Bohannon for three, long range, no, clock ticks, and we're coming to the end, and the Tennessee Volunteers survive and advance. The Vols are going back to the Sweet 16.